everyone! Today I'm going to be doing a daytime look using the Naked palette. I did a daytime and nighttime look using the Naked 2 and I got a request to do that same kind of thing using the first Naked palette. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm doing the daytime look today and then in the future I will be doing the nighttime look. So if you are interested in this video then definitely stay tuned. Alright, so I'm going to start off by using my Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin, and I'm applying this all over my eyelid, up to my brow bone, and also down my lower lash line. I like using this primer potion when I want to add just some extra color to my eyelids. Now I'm going into my Naked palette, and I'm picking up the color Buck on this Sonia Kasha crease brush, and I'm applying this in and above my crease, and this is just going to help me later on when I have to blend out the darker colors that I'm going to be using. I'm using my Eco Tools smudge brush and I'm picking up some of the color called Smog and I'm placing this in my crease and also in the outer corner of my eyelid. And I'm building this color up. I don't want to start off too dark because this is supposed to be a daytime look. So I'm just going to build the color up until I have the perfect amount on. And this just depends on your preference. Whatever you like, that's what you go with. I went pretty light but still, like, it's still going to define my eyes. Then I'm taking my favorite crease brush slash blending brush by Costco and I'm just going to blend out the colors. And then I'm using an e.l.f. $1 shader brush and I'm taking smog again and just deepening up the outer corner and kind of blending it into my crease a little bit. With the same blending brush I'm just going to blend out smog a little bit and then I'm going to pick up some more smog and place it on that e.l.f. shader brush and just drag it on my lower lash line. Then with this Sonia Kashuk shader brush I'm picking up Sin and applying this all over my eyelid, kind of concentrating it on the like first half of my eyelid. With the same shader brush, I'm picking up Virgin and applying this to the inner portion of my eyelid and this is just going to brighten up the eyeshadow look a little bit. And then I'm just going to blend it out with my blending brush again. Still using the same eyeshadow brush, I'm picking up Half Baked and applying this strictly to the middle of my eyelid and this is just going to give my eyes some dimension and then I'm blending it out and then I think I lost some of Smog which is the darkest color I've been using so I'm applying some of that with my e.l.f. shader brush and also my Eco Tools smudge brush. I'm taking my Eco Tools shader brush and picking up Virgin and applying it underneath my eyebrow as a highlight. Once I'm done doing this, I'm blending again, and in my opinion, you can never blend too much, so blend, blend, blend. Now I'm taking Physician's Formula Gel Eyeliner in brown and just doing a very um, small and soft line on my upper lash line. It doesn't have to be perfect because I'm going to smudge it out. I'm just doing this to add a little bit of definition and just an extra pop to my eyeshadow. Now I'm using my L'Oreal Telescopic Shocking Extensions Mascara and applying a couple coats to my lashes until they look absolutely perfect. And that's pretty much it guys. Super simple, a perfect daytime look for school, work, or just hanging out. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Definitely like it if you did enjoy it. and. Until next time, have a great day.